touch screens have made various devices so simpler to use. It's so amazing. A simple tap, little swipe and the required task is done. You'll find them everywhere from smartphones to laptops, computer screens, they're everywhere. But how do they exactly work? Let's find out. One of the most basic systems mostly used in ATMs is the resistive touchscreen system. It consists of two electrically conductive layers, one of which is resistive and the other one is a conductive layer. These two layers are separated by spacers which keeps them apart until you touch it. A scratch resistant layer on top completes the whole setup. An electrical current runs through the two layers at all times. When you touch the screen, the two layers are pressed together and the electrical current changes at the point of contact. The change in electrical field and its coordinates are calculated by the software which further carries out function corresponding to that spot. Although this system is durable and consistent, they can only handle one touch at a time. That is why high-end devices most likely use capacitive touch screens. Now how does a capacitive touch screen system works? In the capacitive system, a layer that stores electrical charge constructed from materials like copper or indium tin oxide is used. Sensors at the corners and a protective casing completes the whole setup. A minute amount of voltage is applied at all corners of the touchscreen. Now how does it work? You see, our body can conduct electric current. So when a user touches the screen with his or her finger, some of the charge is transferred to the user. This is sensed at each corner of the screen. The electric current value at each corner will differ according to the touch point. This relative difference aids the software to find exactly where the touch took place and further it carries out the function corresponding to that spot. iPhones, most mid-range to high-end smartphones, tablets and computers use this system. The next less common and less precise one is the infrared touchscreen system. It consists of LEDs and light detecting photo cells arranged on the opposite sides of the screen. The LEDs shine infrared light in front of the screen, a bit like an invisible spider's web. If you touch the screen at certain point, you interrupt two or more beams. This aids the controller to find the exact location of the touch and the corresponding function is carried out. Since you're interrupting a beam, infrared screens work just as well whether you use your finger or a stylus or even using it with gloves on. But in case of capacitive touchscreen, wearing gloves and operating it will not work since it doesn't conduct electric current. You'll find infrared touchscreen mostly used in Amazon Kindle Touch and Sony eBook readers. And thus this another fascinating technology which surprisingly detects your fingers using sound instead of light. Ultrasonic sound which are too high pitched for humans to hear are reflected back and forth across its surface. When you touch the screen, you interrupt the sound beam and the location of the touch is calculated. Touch screen technology is incredibly easy to use and I think we'll be seeing this in most devices in future. Hope you enjoyed this video. Do you own any touch screen device and what touch screen system it has? Do share it with us in the comment box below. Don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Share this video and subscribe if you're here for the first time. Stay happy, stay curious.